What's up everybody, I'm Dr. Josh Tagoda. Today I'm gonna to show you how to start rehabilitating your shoulder even after you just injured it. Uh, a lot of times when we just injure a shoulder, a lot of people don't have the range of motion. It hurts to go through a lot of movements and stretching is kind of out of the game. So what can you do to start getting that mobility back? Um, there's a couple things, but the first thing I'm gonna show you is this thing called Codman's exercise. It's a really, really simple exercise, and all you do is you can put your hand over uh, a dresser, or you can put your hand like this, or like this. And all you're gonna do is let your shoulder kind of like hang, and you can just use your the weight of gravity, or you can use a little bit of musculature to help start guiding that shoulder into a, a range of motion. And if you notice, I'm just letting like almost like the weight of gravity do everything. I can go side to side a little bit, just getting like stirring the pot, going backwards, either way. It doesn't matter, you're just getting range of motion, but you're not actively going through this forceful range of motion, especially if it's really injured, guys, especially if you're post-operative or you just fell on it, you just strained the heck out of it, you're gonna wanna let the first phase of tissue healing occur, which is the healing soft tissue uh, and getting some movement back. So that is one. The second, couple exercises you're going to want to do is what we call isometrics. Isometrics is when we push our up against the door or some sort of force where the muscle doesn't change in length. And all you're going to do is do some basic movements. You're going to do flexion, you can do extension if you want, you can do abduction, but you're not going to go into these internal external rotations right now. You're just going to go forward, backwards, and pretty much side. So all you need is a door and you could just go your hand up against the door just like this and you're just gonna push into the door like this. And you're gonna hold it for five seconds, 10 seconds, 15 seconds. And a lot of people think you're really trying to shove the door. Guys, you are not trying to do that. All you're trying to do is initiate some contraction within the deltoid and the shoulder girdle and the, and the rotator cuff muscles. So that's one. The second one you're going to do is extension, right? We're gonna get a little tricep activation a little bit of lat, a little posterior cuff here, and then we're just gonna push backwards, okay? And then the final one is abduction. We're just gonna go here, and we're just gonna push into the door going this way. So I'm gonna leave this door open just a little bit so you can kinda of see. I'm just pushing into the door like that. And I'm just gonna hold that in this position, and I'm actually giving about 15% effort for about 10 to 15 seconds, and then I release, and then I could cycle through those all three times to get 15 seconds, 15 seconds, 15 seconds, and then repeat that three different times. So guys, if you just hurt your shoulder, this is a great exercise for you to start building strength and movement back in there so that this way you don't have to go through all these full ranges of motion and risk injury. Again, this is great for re-injuries, new injuries, and those people who are post-surgical or just got out of some sort of arth or arthroscopic surgery or even major surgery. But if that's the case, guys, make sure you consult your practitioner. But this is a great exercise to start with. All right, guys, I'm Dr. Josh Jagoda. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you guys in the next episode. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you want to see more videos.